In this video, I'm going to set up an Azure site-to-site -site VPN connection. There's basically five components that make up the VPN connection. The virtual network gateway, the virtual network, the local network gateway, the public IP address, and then the connection resource. So let's get started by creating a resource group. We're going to put it in the East U.S. region. Okay, we got our new resource group. So the next thing we need to do is create the virtual network gateway. Give it a name. Same region, it's route based. For the skier, we're going to go with basic. We don't have a network created yet, so let's create the virtual network. We've already got our resource group. And as far as the network goes, we can go with these default ones here, or we can create new ones. Um, I'm going to go ahead and go with the default here, 10.0.0.0 slash 16. Then for the subnet, let's call it uh, test subnet. Dot zero slash twenty four. We'll hit OK here. And then we need to create a public IP address. Let's call it test IP. And if we wanted to have two active VPN connections, we would enable this. But since this is just for a test, I'm going to leave it disabled. Same with BGP. So let's hit review and create. This is validation pass, so let's hit create here. This is going to take a while, so I'm going to pause the video. Just a warning about creating this virtual network gateway. I'm at um, 30 minutes still creating. So as soon as it's done, I'll be right back. OK, finally, this thing is finished here. So we should have our virtual network gateway with two other components. So let's go to the resource group. Okay, here we go. Here's our public IP address. Here's our virtual network. And here's our net virtual network gateway. So now that we've got three of the five components created, we now need to create a local network gateway. Click on Add. Give it a name. Okay, so for the IP address, this is going to be the WAN IP for our on-premises network. Let's make up one here. And the address space is the uh, private subnet that's uh, at our local. Premises. So let's just 
make up one here, 168, 200, that's zero, 24. It's great. Okay, so if we get back to the resource group. Okay, that didn't take very long. Um, so now we have the local network gateway set up. So our last component is creating the connection. So let's go to add connection to create. And we're going to do a site to site connection resource group East US. Hit OK. And now we're going to, we're going to select our virtual network gateway that we created earlier. And our local network gateway we just created, test RG. And then we have to create a shared access key. So let's just call it squared one, two, three, four. We're not using BGP. We're not using Azure private IP address. So let's hit okay. Okay, again, it's validating. All right, so let's go back to our resource group. It's still creating the connection, okay. Okay, it created the connection, so let's go to the connection here. Now we need to download the configuration file. So we need to choose the type of device you have, I'm just going to go with a generic example. Download here at the bottom. Save it. All right, so here's all the information we need to set up the VPN connection on our side, on the on-premises side. Okay, so once you've set up the connection on premises equipment, come back to the console here and you should see connected under the connections resource. So that's how you set up an Azure site-to-site -side VPN. If you have any suggestions or comments, please leave those below.